So I do recommend um, if you if you need to use a public toilet, you know, you're walking around anywhere in Thailand that has a temple, and you probably know they're everywhere temples, and monks live there, right? So there's always public toilet free. Sometimes it's not so clean, and sometimes it is very clean. So it just it's just hit and miss. Depends on the monks. <laughs> but check it out. And now I'm going to show the variety of toilets in Thailand. Enjoy. Uh, please uh, subscribe if you like it. Like or comment also, why not? This is probably the most basic of public toilets. And it's pretty clean and modern. Um, so it's a squat toilet. You know, it's porcelain. There's no flushing. The flushing system is with the bucket and this basin of water. Now, that's also how you clean yourself. So that's what I mean that it's the most basic of toilets, even if it is quite clean. Next up in level of public toilet is the squat toilet with a handheld bidet, the bum gun. So you do, you are expected to, with no flush, of course, like no plumbing for flushing. Well, there's plumbing underneath, but you know what I mean, like no uh, handle to flush the toilet. So you just load that up with water. There is a, um, a hand, uh, a little, a, a large ladle, you know, um, and then you just scoop it, you just go like this, when you're finished. So you don't have to use this to clean yourself, but you need to use this to flush it. That's what you use to clean yourself, the handheld bidet, if nobody's ever seen one, it's very simple. You just go like that on your bottom. Uh -huh. I won't demonstrate <laughs> because you can't do nudity in <laughs> YouTube. So here we have an example of a squat toilet. This is, these are all public toilets, right? Squat toilet with handheld bidet and a f it's a fl it's a flush toilet. So that's a, a, also a different level because you don't have to use. Uh, a bucket of water to flush. This, you would be surprised, this I saw in Japan sometimes. Usually in places like city parks or something like that. Flush squat toilet with a handheld bidet. <laughs> this one is a step up in the sense that it's western style toilet. However, no toilet paper provided, and as you can see, the same system with a bucket and water. This is also, this is used to clean yourself, and it's also used to flush. For example, if you just pee as a man, um, you just use the bucket and water to flush. There is no show you. You see, there is no flushing like that. This one is a western style toilet with no bidet toilet paper. Now when they do supply you with toilet paper in Thailand and a lot of the developing world, it is accompanied with signs like this. Please do not throw tissue paper and sanitary napkins in the toilet bowl. Okay, and also, please do not step on the toilet seat, because that's a big thing. People who are used to squat toilets do like to stand on the toilet, you know, or squat on the toilet with their feet on the seats. And one of the big reasons they don't like that they break the toilet seat eventually. 
Okay, the last one in our video of public washrooms, public bathrooms, public toilets. Washroom is Canadian English. <laughs> I probably already said that. So, this is the pinnacle. This is the Japanese toilet. And this is a public washroom. It is at Terminal 21, one of the fancier shopping centers in Bangkok. But most of the fancy shopping centers have these. So if you've never seen one, there are buttons for to stop it, for soft or hard, the pressure can go up or down, you control it. Uh, there's front for women, the dryer, and temperature control as well. 